and Roly too. Lofty and Wendy join the crew. Bob and the gang have so much fun. Working together, they get the job done. Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can. Bilchard and Bird, Travis and Spud, playing together like good friends should. Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can. Yeah. Morning, Mr Ellis. How's tricks? <laughs> Get it? That's your magician's outfit, isn't it? <laughs> yes, Mr Dixon. Ah, you've brought my new doves. Aren't they splendid? Hello there. Where are they going to live? Oh, I've asked Bob to build them a dovecote. He's bringing it round later today. Sounds great. Anyway, I'd better be off. See ya. Bye. Hmm. I think I'll call you Frida. And you can be Bertie. Mr. Ellis! Hello! I've got your eggs! Cool! Hey! I just said that! Cool! Ah, oh, they're clever birds! Much nicer than horrible squawky crows! Why are they in that cage? Well, Spud, I don't want to let them out just yet. They need to get used to being here first. Oh, I see. Oh, dear. Oh, oh. I wish I didn't have to go to work. I'd rather not leave them alone today. I could look after them. I've finished all my deliveries now. Oh, go on, Mr Ellis, please. Well, they do seem oh, to like oh. you. It'll be fun looking after birds instead of scaring them away. Ha-ha! <laughs> Spud on the job! Now then, Spud's going to keep an eye on you, so make sure you're good for him. Oh, oh. And and remember, whatever you do, you mustn't let them out. Don't you worry, Mr Ellis. They'll be safe with Spud. I've done a drawing of Mr Ellis's dovecote, Wendy. It's lovely. I promised Mr Ellis we'd have it finished today. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. I'm back with the word for the dove thingy. It's a dovecote muck. <laughs> right. Let's get you unloaded. Oh. Oh, watch this. <laughs> Brilliant. Now, what else can we do? Ah, uh, aha. Mr Ellis won't mind if I borrow his magic cloak. For his next trick, Spud the Magician will make the doves disappear. Abracadabra. Oh, it didn't work. Now, listen, you lot. When I say the magic words, you have to go invisible. Got it? <laughs> Abracadabra! <laughs> Spud the magician does it again! Uh oh, I've magicked you on the roof! Oh no, a door! I'm going to be in so much trouble. How many doves will live in there, Wendy? Just a few to start with, Dizzy. But when they've settled in, they'll probably have some babies. Oh. Right, that's everything we need. I'm just going over to Mr Ellis's garden to work out where the dovecote will go. OK, Bob. Here, dovey doveys. <laughs> oh, come on, you've got to get back in your cage. Oh. Oh, all right then. Oh, oh. It means please go back in your cage. Oh, right. I'm just going to have to come up there and get you. Aha! Spot to the rescue. Right, you lot. Stay there. Whoa! Oh, no! Oh, I'm sinking! Oh, I'm stuck! Oh, help! Oh, 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 well, it's oh. no good cooing at me. Go and get help! That's funny. Where have the doves gone? Um, they're here, Bob. Spud, what are you doing up there? I was trying oh, to get oh, the doves down oh. and my feet got stuck. Spud, you should never climb on a roof. You could have hurt yourself. Yes, Bob. Sorry, Bob. That's a thatched roof. It's made of straw. Look at the damage you've done. I was only trying to help. Oh, I know, Spud. 
Right, we'd better get you all down. Lofty, can you lift Spud first? Uh, yeah, I think so, Bob. Right, Spud, hook it under your belt and hold tight. OK, Bob. Oh, 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 whoa! Oh, great. The doves have come down too. Phew. Thanks, Lofty. Right, we'd better get them all back in the cage. Leave it to me, Bob. In you get. Oh, shoot. On. Well, that's very good, Spud. <laughs> Spud the dove! <laughs> <laughs> I like that, Lofty. Shall I get you some straw now, Bob, so you can mend the roof? That's a very special job, Spud. I can't do it, but luckily I know someone that can. Hello, Katie. Thanks for coming over. That's all right, Bob. What's the problem? Whoops. <laughs> How did that happen? Oh, sorry, Katie. That was my fault. Well, I've seen worse. Don't worry. I'll soon have that repaired. Oh, you're a really good thatcher, Katie. Well, I tell you what, Spud. You see that straw bird up on the roof? Oh, yeah. Well, it's called a corn dolly. In the old days, they were used by thatchers to bring good luck. Really? I could show you how to make one. Oh, yes, yes, yes and yes. You! Finished. Oh, yeah, yeah! Right, we'd better get it over to Mr Ellis's cottage. I'll join you later, Bob. I, I want to clear up first. OK, Wendy. Bye-bye. Bye, bye. bye everyone. That's it. Now, tuck that bit in there. Hi, everyone. The roof is all fixed. Now we just need to put the dove cut up. Scoop, can you dig a hole for me over here? No prob, Bob. Lofty, you can put the dove cut down while Scoop's digging. I'll help Lofty. Oh, um... Oh, no! I've done it again. Sorry, Bob. It's OK, Spud. It was an accident. But I'll have to go back for some more wood to fix it. Come on, Scoop. Hang on. You could thatch the dovecot roof, Katie. That's a smashing idea, Spud. Why don't you help me? Well done, Spud. That's a great thatch. But there's just one thing missing. Oh, no. What? Your corn dolly. Why don't you finish making it while we put up the dovecot? Oh, yeah. Spuds on the job. Can we build it? Yes, we can! Uh, yeah, I think so. Gently does it. That's it. Ready for your cement now, Dizzy. Coming right up! I've finished! <laughs> it's a corn dovey! <laughs> yeah, can you put it on for me, Lofty? OK, Spud. That looks like great impressive! Oh, oh, oh. We've got the wood. Don't worry, Bob. We won't be needing that now. You've thatched the dovecut roof. It was all Spud's idea, Bob. And he did it himself. Well, uh, uh, Katie helped me. Goodness me, what a splendid job. Thanks, Mr Ellis. Everyone's worked really hard. Now, why don't we see if the doves like their new home? Excellent idea, Bob. How exciting. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> I think they've made oh. a new friend already. Spud, the doves oh. on the job. Oh. 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 What'd you say your name was again? Frida. Oh, that's a nice name. 